Hey, how are ya? So, I had my niece come over today and she did my hair green on the ends. Yeah, now I've got some color, but if I don't want it, I can get rid of it. Okay, so, I we've been back from Disney. We got back late Monday night. Tuesday was back to work. Wednesday's back to work. And I'll be honest, it is weird being back in Gainesville. Driving through the city, um, or the town, it's not really a city, thank God. <clears throat> and just all the neighborhoods, I mean, I knew this place as a realtor, like, like the back of my hand. I could tell you, I can still tell you about every neighborhood, about the houses, what the houses are like, the layouts, and the list goes on. But now I'm not selling real estate, so I'm just looking at it okay. As a, it's a nice place. <clears throat> But living in this house, when I lived in this house, I had everything the way I wanted it. I had everything organized, everything perfect, and we haven't gotten it there yet. It's still got a ways to go, and I find myself just getting really anxious, and ah, the house is not the way it should be. I used to be OCD about my house. I would not go to sleep until, unless it was perfect. Um, I did a lot of exercises on myself in Goa to break that. Um, and here we are now back in my house. So it's in a space that I know, and I find myself getting super anxious about the house being dirty and the floors needing to be clean and the dishes needing to be done. And it's like, holy crap, <laughs> this is crazy. So today I just started rebuking the devil. I told him to leave me alone. I just started saying affirmations of my house is perfect and it's just exactly the way I need it to be. And just working, I've got to work on some more that really will ring true with me. So that I control this. So I don't go into hyper vigilant and crazy. Because I don't need to. There's no need for that. The house will get where it needs to be when it when we have time. So it doesn't really matter how far along I am in my journey. It's oh so interesting how often I can forget and revert back to how I used to be. And how I've got to really stay vigilant and can watch these, pay attention to these thoughts and pay attention to what I'm thinking and how I'm feeling and use the tools that I know to help me get back to being calm. And I've got a little one, little, little adorable, cute boy, but my God, does he imitate me? <laughs> they say children are your mirrors. I'm starting to really believe it. So that's about it. Mr. John, how are you, darling? It's good to see you. Hey, Tony. Beautiful Letitia. How are you? I'm we try to connect. It just doesn't happen. But let's make it happen. Phelan, take care of yourself. And Alita, nice to see you on here too. This girl's going to sign off, get some dishes done. And uh, it's 9 o'clock already. Can you believe it? <laughs> I'm going to try to get to bed by 10.30, so I better wrap up. Take care of yourselves. Love, love all y'all. Bye.